Today I'm going to show you how to round any number off to one decimal place. So let's round 5.3287 to one decimal place. So rounding to one decimal place basically means we need one number after the decimal point. So all we need to do then is cut the number off here so we have one number only after the decimal point so we've got two options now we can either round the number down to 5.3 or we can round the number up to 5.4 to decide which one we round to you need to look at the number after the line since this number is less than 5 we round the number down so therefore the answer will be 5.3. Let's do another one. This time let's have a look at 4.2675. So again, one decimal place means we only want our answer, so there's one number after the decimal point. So let's put a line in here. So we're either going to write down our answer as 4.2 or 4.3. Look at the number after the line. Um, since 6 is 5 or above, we round the number up, all right, because it would be close to 4.3. So that's our answer, 4.3. Let's do another one. Let's go with this time 37.1594. Again, all we need to do is put our line in, one number after the decimal point. So our two options are 37.1 if we round it down or 37.2 if we round it up. Again look at the number after the line. If that number is 5 or above you round it up. If it's less than 5 you round it down. So this is exactly 5 so it's 5 or above so we round it up to 37.2. Let's do one last example. So this time let's go with 265.7485. So again, let's round it to 1dp. So this means we want one number after the decimal point. So two options then are 265.7. That's if we round it down, you keep it the same. If you're rounding it up, it'll become 265.8. So again, look at the next number after the line, which one it's closer to. Uh, this time, the number after the line is less than 5, so we round the number down. In other words, we just keep it the same. So it's closer to 265.7.